Happy New Year, Scorpio! Welcome to 2019. Here we are, another year, another, another year has come in. Who knew? It is just happening. That wheel just keeps turning every time. So for you, Scorpio, make sure you go and listen to the big long babble I made, so I don't have to repeat myself here. And um, there's a couple of eclipses happening this month, so you you need to really build on your public life and your reputation, uh, Scorpio. This is really your month to do all that stuff. It's all of our months to do that stuff, but I really feel it for you. Uh, especially since I know most Scorpios that I personally know are in showbiz or entertainment or communication of some sort. So it's definitely uh, time to do all that. And Scorpio is always very aware that, you know, our, we're all going to die and we don't have a lot of time but really um, take another look at your agenda and at your life and, and make sure you're on the path doing the things that you want to do and need to do maybe there's more you want to do um, it really is an auspicious time to pick up some courses whether you're going back to school college university high school uh, maybe you want to be an apprentice take some apprenticeship or be an intern so you can learn more about various crafts or take some online courses you can do at home in your underwear and you don't have to worry about getting all gussied up to go out in the world because I know Scorpio women really are beautiful and I know some of you it takes a while to get that way no <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> it's not that you're not naturally beautiful. You just don't believe you are. And so you pile on the makeup. But we all know how gorgeous you are in real life with no makeup at all. Because Scorpios are very interesting looking people. Uh, we all know that. And uh, so you really need to express yourself. And also be aware that there will be some finalities this month, especially for you, because you're all about the final answer anyways. And so there's going to be some stuff you've just like, you know what, we're done, it's over. Might be a job, might be relationships, might be uh, lifestyle changes, whatever. And that's fine. Change is good. So really, really use the energy of those two eclipses that are coming up in January to really activate your life and get to where you want to go. Get back on track if you've fallen off. And if you're still on the right path, just keep moving along that path because there's some twists and turns coming up and you'll be ready for them because you don't suffer any fools and you're going to use your head and just get through it okay so cut away the fools from your life and move forward with gusto <laughs> see you in february